Hello everybody and welcome to my e-lesson. I am your guru and in this video I will tell you how to use the if formula with the and and the or formula. Uh, we, we are testing two very very unique uh, beautiful conditions over here. See uh, this is the eighth video in the if formula series that I've created and in this formula also in this uh, video also I've used Superman's sales as the example. <laughs> now there are two conditions that we need to check. The first one is that Superman's sales have to be at least $100,000 and his new customers for the month he should have brought in at least 200 new customers so if he meets these two criteria he should get an incentive that is one condition and if he is and and part two and and if he is able to meet either one of these criteria, even then he should be given an incentive so these are the two things we need to check so First condition with the and formula sales and new customers has to match so over here see uh, Superman sales for the month are 40,000 which is obviously less than one lakh one hundred thousand dollars and his customers added for the new month is two are uh, 234 which is obviously greater than 200 which is the requirement still he is not eligible because both the conditions are not met in this scenario scenario two wherein either one of these has to meet he is eligible because his customer count is greater than what is required now how did we do it using the formulas let us test scenario one wherein both the conditions need to meet scenario one is is equal to if now instead of giving this logical test I'll be putting in the and formula now what AND formula does is that it can ask you to put in n number of logics, logical uh, conditions and all of them have to be met for a for AND value formula to give you a true result. Alright. So the first condition is that the sales have to be greater than the target sales. Comma. Second condition is that the number of customers figure should be greater than the target for number of customers bracket close again comma now if formula resumes automatically it says value if true so value if true is if true eligible and uh, and if value is not met then it should be not eligible and let us see he is coming not eligible and let's try the same thing with the or formula now how would the or formula work is is equal to if and bracket open if sales is greater than the target sales comma new customers brought in is greater than the target given bracket close comma value if true eligible value if not true would be not eligible all right close the bracket he has come as not eligible reason because i mentioned and instead of or that's a mistake i have done see haha <laughs> we got it all right so uh i hope you like this video so until the next video keep on practicing this one how well well you can simply download this workbook Go to mylesson.org, find this video over there, if formula video number 8, and download the file. As simple as that, it's totally free. Always is free, will always be free. So, until the next video, this is your Guru now signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.